So I used to be a woman and now I have a beard and I look like a man. I don't wake up every day bounding out of bed with rainbows shooting out of my ass. It's not every day. I'm Kit Volcano. I'm Rosie Volcano. And we are the creators of The Little Volcano. Yes! The Little Volcano is a coaching company. I'm a vibrant, unchanged, uncategorical beacon. Coaching with The Little Volcano Group in one word has been expansive. To discover who I am um, and not judge that. We've both been told in different ways growing up that we were too much. Those are the people we invite in. If you really have to define it by just like two words, who are the little volcanoes? They're too much. Too much. Tribe of too much. I feel really loved by all of you right now. Mm -hmm. you, are. You, are. you are. You are. They're too much for sure. But so am I in a way. I think what spoke to me more was how they really walked the talk and that they stood behind the message that they were saying. And so all of the other stuff that's really colorful didn't matter to me. This world needs to see that life is dramatic and it's okay to be too much. What we're doing is unwinding all of our bullshit stories and stepping into our power and our vision and our magnificence and our beauty. I think that everyone takes from it what they need. People who, are, who know they're meant for more, who know they're meant for greatness, who know they're meant to break out of that box and show themselves to the world, those are the kind of people we want to work with. You've got one of two options. You can either chicken out and continue living the way that you've been living before, or you can just dive in and do it. We're here to empower people to learn how to stand up for their own worth, their own value, and really become the person that they want to be. Nothing great was ever achieved by just one person on their own. <laughs> Having someone on your team to say, it's okay, pick yourself up again. You're still perfect, you're still loved. What I love about coaching is that it's not advice giving. It's somebody who gives you a different perspective on your life. The how to, people figure out really quickly as soon as they believe in themselves. When you see people put themselves out there, you can give yourself permission to do the same. My vision is to love myself fully and to love that I'm trans. For me, the whole transgender movement wasn't huge when I was young. It wasn't so accessible. So you just learn to deal with what you're given without any idea that you could change it. This is scary. What did you just do? I just took my first tee shot. <laughs> cool. What do you want to do now? We're going bowling. This is my voice. Five minutes on tee. By the time I got a beard, I was like, oh yeah, I should have done this a long time ago. This feels really great. When he transitioned, there was no hesitation or fear on my end being his partner. I'm just very open to all that stuff to begin with. Everything that we do together is about growing and transforming. I got a baby volcano. I feel magical. A phrase that we use a lot is do the magic first. We're doing the magic. We got baby daddy action going on over here. <laughs> <laughs> the dirty details are behind the scenes. We made a delivery from that, from the room Ryan and I were in, um, in a cup, to the room that Kit and Rose were in. The rest is part for the medical books, I suppose. The idea of having this four parent family with Lot and Ryan and Rosie is going to bring up a lot of people's uncertainty about what their what family means, what love means. We've had some some contrast between us and our relationship that we were able to communicate about and move through really really beautifully and we all just have faith that we are going to be able to move through whatever challenges come up in the same way.
Oh, oh my god, it's the birth certificate! Oh, it's, right. it's got all of our names wow. on it! It's birth certificate! When you hone your communication skills, when you open yourself to love people, when you open yourself to see people differently, and really let them in, you can create incredible things together, like a new paradigm for the way family is. We're living this life that's really fun and weird and quirky, and we have a really good time doing it, and we're successful. This path that we're on with the coaching and the transformative work and the little volcano, it's absolutely my life purpose. A lot of people go into this coaching industry to change the world. I'm really just looking to make an impact on the person in front of me yeah. and have it spread. We're helping people discover their own sense of self-worth so that they don't have to struggle. Coaching is something you really can't do on your own. I can't hold all the weight of your transformation, but I can build something incredibly beautiful and teach everyone how to hold each other up.